Hello, hello, crafty friends. Welcome back to my channel. It's me, Wendy, Glued with Love. So happy that you're here with me today. Today is release day for Scrap D Diva Designs, and it was pushed back a few days because there was some um, exciting new uh, dies she wanted to make sure she received and put in this month's release, and it was so worth the wait. Uh, you'll be able to see the shift change here when I show you the dies, and it's so, so fun. Um, Here's her information, Scrap Diva Designs. Uh, this is a paid partnership. I am an affiliate for her. So my affiliate code is Wendy10. And if you are inspired by anything and you wanna save money, please use that code. It does help me and my channel. So I appreciate your time and thanks for tuning in today. Um, the first die that we have is a paint tube and it comes in two different sizes, a large and a small, and it also can be turned into a shaker. So I am so excited about this die. It is super, super cute. It even has like a little paint brush with a little squiggly uh, showing that, you know, the, the paint is being squirted out of your, your paint tube. Super fun. Uh, the next one is a, what is this one? This is the handbag topper. Um, bag topper this is the small one and i cre i embossed some paper and created this gorgeous small little bag topper so this is a small bag topper and there's also a large one let me pull the large one here is the large size and i embossed and i also glazed uh, the paper to kind of look give it a little pearly uh accent and then i added some uh little uh half back pearls to it and a little half back pearl to the top to kind of just give it some um some girliness a super cute little bag topper again this is the large purse and the other one is the small one so let me let me hold them both together um for reference so you can see the difference so this is for a small bag and the large bag so fun, huh? I can just can imagine all the beautiful papers that can be used to make a gorgeous purse, vintage purse. Uh, so much fun, so much fun. So definitely, definitely one of my favorite ones because I just it's just so girly and so cute. So let me know what you think about the purse back toppers. Uh, the next is a um, this is a pocket. It is a rainbow pocket. Let me see what it's called. Rainbow pocket die set. There we go. And it's basically, you're gonna have a little pocket area and it's gonna have the rainbow around it. Super, super fun, guys. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. I have tons of ideas for that. Uh, the next one is a 3D mini vial box. So basically the little containers that come from Dollar Tree, they have the smaller ones and the larger ones will fit in here. But I'm thinking there, you could also maybe fit like one of these little small glues in there. I think I think that would fit, but I don't know. I have to try it out to kind of see first if that really works. But I'm going to try to see if I can find other little things that can fit in here besides those little um, those little vases. So that's the next item on the release. The next one is this is a these are purse handles, but they can be used for all kinds of things. Not necessarily a purse handle, but when we go to make like treat bags or different items, we want you know to be able to go to and get a certain strap to make a backpack or backpack handles, purse handles. Uh, this can be used as layering pieces on cards. Just very versatile. So this also is gonna be an amazing staple piece. Again, this is called the purse strap bundle. But look at all the different intricate designs in here. Super, super fun. I love it because you've got a small, a thinner ones that can also be added on top of your larger one. So definitely, definitely, um, this is a, a go-to one for me, so I'm, I'm, I'm really happy about that. <laughs> and this is, this, this is the, the shift. So what I'm totally excited about is that now that they are teal, we all know that's my favorite color, yay! Uh, but you, you're gonna know now that if you buy a Scrap Diva die, they're gonna be teal. So those are gonna be your ultimate dies to have because they're gonna be uh, color co they're gonna be color coded. You'll know which ones are Scrap Divas dies because now they're they're color coded. So super super fun. This is the mail truck mini album. But it can be used as anything like any kind of truck. Like it can be a treat box, it can be a mini album, it can be an embellishment. Um 
super, super fun. So I did create something with this as soon as I got it because I was so excited about this. I created a mini, mini embellishment book, which I turned into a Hello Kitty Cafe, which I was inspired by the actual Hello Kitty Cafe truck that comes to our town about once a year. And you can buy all kinds of Hello Kitty, Hello Kitty goodies and Hello Kitty, um, like you can buy food and you can buy bags, you can buy thermoses, you can buy t-shirts. They come around and they actually sell all kinds of cool stuff out of their Hello Kitty truck. So I am I was so excited when I saw the truck. I'm like, Eek! I'm going to use Hello Kitty. So uh, I actually popped this up on foam and, and it comes with a little light to add to it, the little bumper. It comes with the wheels. Uh, I did have this Hello Kitty in my stash. This is Hello Kitty's, uh, Hello Kitty's, this is Scrap Diva's um, alphabet uh, die in her shop as well. So I did use her alphabets uh, to type out the Hello Kitty Cafe. And then I just created some different uh, embellishments to add to my embellishment book. So we've got frappes, we've got Bo Hello Kitty bobas, and we've got some Hello Kitty donuts. So this is just a fun way to share some embellishments in a crafty swap with your crafty friends. Super fun, huh? Yes, yes, I was so excited about that. So I do have another idea for that as well. So again, that's the um, mini truck um, mini album, mail truck mini album, but it can be used as any kind of truck. It's super, super cool. Uh, we do have a embossed heart with some different stamps. Uh, we have snail mail, snail mail gift card. So to send a cute gift card via snail mail. So the, the theme here is basically like happy mail and mail. So definitely you need an envelope for that. Uh, this kind of mimics her Valentine uh conversation hearts but these are now the crafty word hearts uh hello crafty friend let's swap goodies you've got this you are loved and handmade super fun to add different embellishments to your snail mail and happy mail um we've got stamps you've got a postage stamp happy mail and various stamps to use in happy mail super super fun i love this i love it Snail mail, happy mail, the little postage stamp, and the the die, the coordinating die to go with it. And this one is called the swap bag envelope, and it does come with its layering pieces. So this is an envelope with a pocket to add um, embellishment, sequence, mix, or to just mail out a gift card in. And we have a cute, cute, cute little bear. This one's called cute bear. And you have a small and a large, and it has the little hand, so you can put them in to be peeking out of something if you want. Super fun and super cute. Oh, I'm just in love with these colors. The next is a heart gift bag. And this is a pretty large gift bag. Uh, super fun for treats. So this is about four inches by five inches. So it's a pretty good pretty good sized treat bag and you've got the layering pieces for the, the the top that flips on top and then your your side pieces on your bag super super fun oh my gosh these colors it's just amazing I love it I love it and then last but not least is the snail mini album now it can be used as an embellishment or a mini album and it comes with its cute little face and you've got the layering pieces for the snail snail mini album yes 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 so let me know which one was your favorite piece and what you're going to order again if you have any questions uh please leave a comment and i'll get back to you as soon as i can and i can't wait to see what you make happy crafting talk to you later bye